OK, the last part uh, of the first tutorial will be to adapt the size of the node according to the degree of the node. So, um, this is not very difficult. Uh, the difficulty is to, to remember that this may change uh, the, the size of the nodes uh, are susceptible to change because the number of uh, links is to change uh, around the, during the model uh, use because we have added some uh, some functions that uh, remove some uh, nodes remove some links and so on and so on so the number of nodes and links are, are varying so the degree of the remaining nodes will also evolve so we have to adapt the size every time the model is changed like for tick to warn the observer that the model's uh, state has changed, we will have to call our functions that will resize the nodes every time the network has changed. So, uh, we start by uh, creating the function that will uh, adapt the size according to the degree. So, uh, we will uh, say, we will call this function update size, maybe. Update size, okay. Um, with end at the end, okay. So uh, what we want to do is to change the size of uh, the turtle. Size is a built-in variable that already exists. Remember that I have I have used it at the setup in the setup function. Set size to size is a, it's an attribute of the turtles of NetLogo. So there is already a variable uh, that we can set. So the idea is to um, to count, uh, to to get the degree and to make the size equal to the degree. So we, we can try set size. Uh, so degree is not uh, directly available. Remember, we have to count the neighbors of um, of uh, of the of the node. So um, oh, sorry, I forgot something. Um, we will do that for every node. So we have to ask every node, so every turtle, turtles to modify their size. Sorry, I forgot the ask turtle part. But still, once you are, uh, once you have uh, the turtles to do something, you say uh, set size equal to degree. So set size equal to the count, the number of link neighbors. Okay. So this is a function update size. Um, we should check if it works by adding a little button. So update size. Okay. Okay. So it works because uh, I have added a lot of um, of uh, of links to the selected uh, node before, so the degree is very important. It is in fact too important to be displayed this way. So the degree itself alone is uh, too high uh, for the, for uh, putting the the size equal to it. We have to 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 skew the um, the size to to compress the size. One good function for that is the square root or the logarithm. I will use the square root. So instead of uh, counting neighbors, I will take the square root sqrt of the uh, neighbors of the number of neighbors. Yeah, this is much better. The proportion is still uh, uh, respected, but the, it's, it is not linear. So uh, the size is uh, I don't know uh, compressed. Okay, so uh, this is cool, but if I add some links, I every time the, the, the model change, I will have to do that by hand. I update size, update size, update size. So we want uh, that to be uh, automatically called. So I will just have to call the function update size everywhere there is the tick. So we have before uh, think about uh, the, the functions that, that ch 
change the structure of the network so when we have put tick at the end of this function so here we have something that has, that has to be called every time the network is changed so just before tick we will we will call this function update size so here update size here okay here also update size and uh, here update size oh and i forgot to put a tick when we remove one node, uh, removing one node change the, the network, so we have to have tick and also update size, okay. Uh, layout does not change the structure of the network, it's only uh, a cosmetic uh, arrangement of the nodes in the, in the world, so we don't, uh, we don't add that, okay. Oh, I have written badly update size, okay. Okay, so now we can remove this button because the uh, update is automatic, and you will see what uh, what happens on a more visible. Um. Okay, so uh, set up, create some links, layout. Okay, now I will remove some links. Okay. You see that uh, the, the size is still a uh, function of the degree because the, this node, for example, has a, has a degree of 1 and is uh, smaller than this node who have a degree of 3. And um, yeah, this is uh, pretty much uh, all we can do for a, a proper um, network manipulation. Under net logo, so this is a very, uh, uh, very beginning of uh, doing some things in networks, just creating a network and uh, display some information on it, controlling its structure, its elements, so nodes, links, and so on, uh, making a nice uh, visualization like uh, with the size. Uh, proportional to degree and this is uh, pretty much uh, what uh, we could uh, do or maybe we can um, decide if the um, if the size has to be proportional to degree maybe you are maybe you want maybe you want not so um, okay uh, first I will s start with the size of one because uh, two is not, uh, not very useful Okay, um, so yeah, uh, we could decide if uh, if the size is proportional or not to the um, to the degree of the node. So we will add a switch. A switch is like a boolean uh, uh, switch uh, trigger. The global variable uh, will be uh, size is degree with a question mark to remember that it's a boolean value and I can decide if uh, size is degree is on or off by clicking on it okay so I will may uh, I will add just a little test on this boolean so if size is degree uh, with a question mark I could add equal true but since it's a bool it's a boolean value uh, you don't have to read to write uh, equal true uh, when it's true it's it, it is executed and when it's uh, false it is not executed so uh, but you have to add a square bracket around the code so um, if size is degree we adjust the size uh, by the uh, by the by the degree of the node. Okay, uh, so for now it's off. Um, okay, so there you see that adding some links won't change uh, the size of the node. But if it is on, 
adding one link will ch will change the the <laughs> the size of the node. Okay. Now we are done. We have seen plots, sliders, button to call functions, uh, boolean switch. Um, we have seen how it's important to to think about the the functions that may modify the state of your system so that the plot and the observers can be aware of the change and to update themselves so okay we have uh, we have made a, a first model of network uh, in netlogo so that's it for the first tutorial um, in the second tutorial we will uh, make some um, uh, some other kind of uh, exercise with networks, maybe um, diffusion of something uh, through um, a network or uh, dynamics like uh, preferential attachment or so something like that. Okay, thank you.